journey begins with a plan, and each plan starts with a step. Medicines Laboratory Center Incorporated started out as a staff corporation organized in the Philippines, established in October 4, 2001, and the number one OFW clinic in Magallanes, Davao City in the year 2007. In the year 2012, Davo Branch is transferred to its new location at the Kodao and Sons Building, San Pedro Street, Corner Anda, Davo City, headed by Ms. Erna G. Pakibar, together with the Medical Director, Dr. Claire Francis Miyaki. Today, MSL Davo is one of the uppermost clinic in the city, bringing and sealed with its vision, mission, and core values, making it into a reality. Vision Medicines Laboratory Center Incorporated will be a world-class health facility which provides high standard medical quality services. Mission We are committed in meeting our customers' requirements in health evaluation and care services for continual improvement of our people, facilities, and diagnostic quality management services cognizant to statutory and regulatory requirements. Core values, honesty, faith, and wisdom. Medicines Laboratory Center Incorporated has been always anchored to its vision and mission, continuing towards the goal to serve every client's medical needs and maintaining to leave the core values. Composed of different heads, doctors, and staff, and its respective department, it become more competitive enough in each craft to do better. By making tasks fulfilling, established process is one of the key to make it systematic and harmonious. As to mention the different departments, these are Administrative Department, Verification and Reception Department, X-ray, Laboratory, Nurse, Neuro, Accounting, Marketing, Records, IT, and maintenance. To be vividly understand, workflow is this course. Good day, this is the reception area, and I'm going to introduce ourselves. This is the step one or the reception one. Hello, I'm Roland Alcover. And I'm in charge of step two or the reception two. I am Jeanette. And the step three. Hello, I'm Betsy Sassan, cashier. In general, reception is the receiving, encoding, and clearing in charge area. Okay. To understand its functions, I will explain to you the process. The first one is greetings and giving instruction or the form of transactions step by step to the applicants before distributing the forms. And these are the forms. Then, uh, the receipt referral forms from the applicants are being filed accordingly. Then, step one will explain to you the process. Hi, I'm Roland, so I'm the step one. I'm assigned in encoding the applicant information on the system. I'm also the in charge for all complete medical bound in the city county from writing the name, age, position, type of exam, and name of the agency. After that, I will stop the applicants to wait their name to be called to proceed to step two. As the process continues from step 1 to step 2, I am going to take pictures, put package to the system, and print out forms to the applicants. Then, all included applicants to the system to be forwarded their papers to the cashier. After that, the applicant should wait to be called by step 3 or the cashier for their payments or if it's filled by agency. Cashier, I am responsible of taking all the payments of the applicants. After the payment, I will accept them to proceed to the laboratory, nurse station, and x-ray department. Furthermore, the reception area must be clean enough to observe each applicant's forms that no miss and accurate details, especially the payments concerned, to so double check and get confirmation from agency to the marketing department to avoid any decision. The reception is the clearing chart as well. 
To see to it that end of the day, all important information of applicants are correct and not misread. Lastly, to, say, to send daily reports such, such boxing and applicants paper in a day such GCC, non GCC, and local. From Medicines Davao, Merry, Merry Christmas! Christmas. Hi, welcome to Medicine Stelvo X-ray Department. I'm Nariza, and this is Joe, and that over there is John. Today, I'm going to show you how we do things here in our department. As you can see, this is the X-ray form that we get from the applicant. We must make sure that all the details are filled up and it is a stamp. After checking, we must ensure that the details that are filled up here matches the one on our clinic probe. After checking, we will put it in our lab. After putting the details of our applicant in the lab book, we must call her and then let her proceed in our dressing room. Address Aisa, pasok po kayo ma. Okay, so when the applicant is in the dressing room, we must give proper instructions. Ang magandang umaga ma, kailangan nyo lang po gawin, tanggalin nyo pa itaas na gamit, t-shirt, bra, print, task. Yung buong buong siguraduhin ganito yung pagkakatali, hindi aabot sa leeg kasi makikita yan sa x-ray mo, ha? So, proceed na po kayo doon sa loob mo. After the instruction, we must encode the details on our near computer. So, after encoding, we will call the applicant and let her proceed in the x-ray mo. Ma, dito po tayo sa kabila. Okay ma'am, so yung gagawin po natin ma'am is mag-exit na yung instruction ng po is hingang malalim, hingang malalim, pigil, relax na kasi hangin yan po ma'am ha. Kamay ko sa likod, ganyan ka po ma'am yan, ganyan po ma'am ha, ganyan po ma'am ha, hintay ka ng instruction ko. Ma'am, tapos na po din yung x-ray natin ha. So yung gagawin mo na lang ngayon ma'am is magpuproceed ka sa ibang isang ng inyong panagawa. Okay? Yung agency na po yung magpukuha ng results mo dito ha. Proceed ka na lang po sa ibang department ma'am. Thank you po. Base ka na ma'am. Hi, I'm Lin Maldurad, Chief Medical Technologies from Laboratory Department, Medicine Staff. Today, I would like to introduce to you my colleagues. First, uh, Ms. Sheena Bakapoli. She handles uh, serology. And also, Ms. Alisa Fernandez, in charge of the neurology section. And Ariel Saranya. Uh, clinical chemistry. Ms. Uh, Maribel Rosano. She had uh, also a uh, clinical microscope. In the pre analytic the patient will get a request form from the reception area and completely fill up the form with name, birth date, contact number, and other information needed. The phlebotomist also check and ask the patient's condition like fainting, dizziness, and tense. To ensure patient's safety, the phlebotomist applies proper blood extraction technique with the correct order of tubes. If lavender top or an anticoagulation tube is used, gently invert to avoid hemolysis and clotting. Labeling is done right after extraction and before the patients will leave the room. All specimens are placed in a test tube rack 
and then carried out to the processing area to be centrifuged. The next stage is the analytic procedure. Consists of the laboratory activities that actually produce a result such running a sample on an automated analyzer. In serology section, samples that are requested for hepatitis profile, HIV, and other immunologic tests are received by a technologist to verify for its identity and the test being requested. After centrifugation, samples are then to be processed using an automated analyzer. In the hematology section, PRAS processes samples requested for CBC, platelet, and other hematological tests. Prior to processing of the sample, the technologist inspects for the specimen condition in case of any discrepancies observed, like clotted blood being detected. In the chemistry section, composing different tests like FBS, lipid profile, and an enzyme are also assayed on an automated analyzer. Lastly, in the clinical microscopy and parasitology, where ur urine and stool are being processed through the microscope. In the post-analysis, the chief medical technologist will validate or review the laboratory reports or results before releasing or transmitting to the records department. Welcome to Nurse Station. My name is Mark. I am a nurse and I will tell you today the process of our daily routine. During our physical examination or before our physical examination, we always prepare the patients before the doctor arrives. First thing to do is we take them, we take their vital signs and then we interview them. During the interview, we give them the dental form and then the priority number. That's for the PE. Another procedure is for the ECG and audiometric. ECG were done for the patients 35 and 40 and above for case-to-case -case basis. And for the audiometry, we give them or we take them to the audiometry room for those applicants under maritime agency. Another procedure is the vaccination. First, we let them write a verification form or we let them write their name in a piece of paper so that we can verify it to our computer. If the patient is for vaccine, we give them form, vaccination form. We have here the vaccination form. We let them, we let them fill it up and then pay it to the cashier before we vaccine them. Lastly is for the consultations, pendings. We also cater those patients. We just let them write their name again in a piece of paper, paper and then we verify it to our computer and then we let them process to the cashier for the payment and then we just let them wait for the doctor arrive. So that's all the procedure for the nursing department. Now we are putting the digitizer. Ito muna tayo sa... Ay, tagalin na natin yung palong sa... Sir, ito yung resulta 
na yan sa inyo. Consultation ka daw. Antayin lang natin sir, tatawagin ka namin kapag ano yun. Aga, antay lang po kayo sa lahat. some of our files. These files are all included to our system and these are all the files filled up by the applicants, vaccine, dental, consultation, consulted by our medical director, ECG, ECG findings read by our medical directors, and we have here our monthly reports, the old files, and clearances. Those cases are referred to our psychologist for clarification. 
filings. For the applicants who has filings, the psychologist make the psychological report and we send it to their agency and we let the agency to do the final decision. And for the encoding, sending daily and monthly report. Right after the evaluation of the psychologist, I encode the result, update the status if the applicants for neuro exam or for evaluation. And print out the result for Marina and other agency as per requested. And I also send daily report to the to the top management. I send also monthly report if how many applicants taken for one month. Finally. For the filing, we have our own storage inside our department. And last but not the least, the disposal. The disposal is every six months. And this is our filing, our storage room here in our department. And as you can see, the, the papers are filed according to date and year. and I would like to introduce to you my co-marketing officers, Ms. Jana Eliza Bonambot. Hi! Ms. Rochelle Texon. Hi! And Mr. Paul Rocket. Hi! Now I will discuss to you the department flow of transaction. The preparation are the things needed. We need to prepare the proposal, letter of confirmation, the marketing itinerary, and the company itinerary that must be approved by the officer in charge, Ms. Erna Papibar, the agency information sheet, the calling card, and the feedback form. Regarding the appointment of visit, we have to greet first the clients. If it is already affiliated in our clinic, we have to give the feedback form and ask their concerns or complaints. And if it is a new client, we have to discuss our proposal and the packages they're in. Hi, good morning, ma'am and sir. I am Rocha Alfixon, Marketing Officer. Regarding the discussion of the proposal, we need to discuss the medical package of a specific destination, which is agency caters. We have the package for the Saudi Arabia, Oman, Bahrain, Qatar, and also for the Kuwait for, for GCC countries. We also have for non GCCs the specific destination, which is Singapore, Dubai, Hong Kong, Korea, and also for Japan. As a marketing, we also have to discuss the medical package, which is the specific destination, such as the pre-med, complete, phase one, phase two, and also for the medical package. Mom and sir, the medicines Davo offering you a good services will be a world class and high facilities, which is provides a high standard medical quality of the services. Good day, I'm Paul Roque, I'm the one to explain feedback and after visit and appointment. If already affiliated in the clinic, with no complaint, we appreciate and thank the agency for continuing their endorsement of medical. Second, if already affiliated in the clinic, we complain and concern as response marketing may explain if he or she can be. But if not, tell the agency that those matter, will be endorsed to our head OIC. Third, if the new client not yet convinced or close deal as of the new schedule of appointment for follow-up. Fourth, if the new clients close deal as the response to agency to assure them that their applicants will be catered well. Let the agency sign the letter of confirmation. Things to do. After visit, make the daily marketing report and send it via email to our heads. When there are close deal clients, also make the CSF or the client specification file for approval. Marketing also make weekly report and monthly report. 
We also conduct monthly departmental meeting and all the dis discussions are recorded and reported to our heads or admin officer. And now, I will present to you the most important thing in the department, the filing. Here are our files, our client specification files that are approved of our head from A to Z. The CSF for local, the CSF for C-base, our marketing monthly report, and our weekly report. Make sure that all files are organized and kept in the department. And be reminded that in marketing, we used to create, keep, and satisfy our clients. From MSL Davo Marketing Department, we wish, wish you a Merry, Merry Christmas! Christmas. Each department have their creativity and the ability to cascade each work exquisitely by being organized and clean. This also reflect to the person.
Laboratory Center Incorporated with its seven distinct branches which is known of Cagayan de Oro, City of Golden Friendship, Zamboanga, City of Flowers, Manila, City of Pearl and Dreams, Cebu, Queen City of the South, Iloilo, City of Love, Bacolod, City of Smiles, Davao, City of the King of Fruits. Ho, 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 ho! Merry Christmas!
as we are being blessed by God or Allah with a unique skills and talent, we are able to share it also through this kind of art. Before we end, we heartily express this number to our dearest CEO and to all Medicine's employees. I've been hearing symphonies